no, this is real off-roading. So everything we expected is like not happening. We gotta go slow, this is really bumpy. A big thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this van life adventure through Iceland. We might be rookies at river crossings and overlanding, but our beautiful website makes us look like real pros. The river crossings like get my heart going so much. That's me, Dana, and that's my husband, Blue. And this is Gregor. He is a ground up rebuild of a military grade Mercedes Benz G Wagon 4x4. He was made with one idea in mind off roading. This six cylinder overlanding camper van has 245 horsepower and two snorkels, which gives Gregor the ability to do river crossings with ease. We got the chance to drive this beautiful Mercedes G Class thanks to Lou's cousin Tim and his wife Rika who asked us to return this incredible off-roading G-Wagon from Iceland to their home in Germany. So yeah, there's a lot more I could say about this whole overlanding adventure through Iceland, but most of all, I'm just grateful. Let me show you why Iceland is the most intense, wild, beautiful place we've ever visited and why it's perfect for van life. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good. Do you see how beautiful the weather is? Yeah. It's incredible. We got a sunny day in Iceland. I didn't think it was possible. When we looked at the weather forecast for the whole trip, it was just like rain, 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 rain. <laughs> oh, I feel like I just took a shower. You're definitely sopping wet, babe. And this is not rain. It's incredible. With all the blackout curtains, you know, because he has them down there and then in here. Lou, we slept till nine o'clock in the morning. That's crazy. We haven't done that in a really long time because it's so quiet here. Quiet and cold and dark. That is what you need for good sleep. But we can like eat breakfast outside. We can have our tea outside. It's so gorgeous out. It's like warm in the sun, Lou. Yeah. Are you excited for today? Mm -hmm. Hey. Do you want me to drive and get to go through the rivers, or are you gonna wanna drive? You can go through the rivers. Really? <laughs> yeah. I can keep off-roading? Yeah. Good job, Dina. Thanks. You're getting the hang of this whole car thing. Right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's really not so hard. <laughs> it does itself. Oh. Love that engineering. Wow, and now we have a ceiling. I know, look at all this space. It's kind of crazy. This is a lot more of a movable space than our van. Yeah, it's a proper living room. Yeah, even my brother could fit in here. Shall we go hiking? We need more than hopes and wishes for us to make it through the night. Stormy weather, weary eyes. Hope to make it through the night. Before this night is over, I will guide you home. This is insane. I, I think it's official. I know I exaggerate all the time, but this is actually the most beautiful place I've ever been. Like, hands down. This is spectacular. Oh, how good does it feel to like actually stretch your legs? Hike again? Okay, found out what to do. 
So what we just did, that extra little loop, mm -hmm. was a crater, but not the crater lake. So it was cool, but not the one with the water. The next one, you keep driving, and then when you see another house like this, you stop, and then there's like a 10 minute hike to a crater with water in it. This one is pretty unreal, isn't it? I cannot believe it. It doesn't make any sense. I feel like we're like on the set of Jurassic Park plus another planet maybe, like an extraterrestrial movie. And on top of that, the weather is incredible. So everything we expected is like not happening because we thought that we would be having horrible, windy, rainy weather. And now it's actually blue skies. It's so cool here. Whoa, now this is real off-roading. We gotta go slow, this is really bumpy. This is so ridiculously beautiful. I can't handle it. Yeah, it's unreal. It really is unreal. I don't understand. It's like every direction you look is breathtaking. Yeah, I saw nothing. It's, yeah. <laughs> I don't even know what the words are. Here we go. very important in Iceland to not go off the trails at all because the moss is so beautiful but it's also very delicate and so that's why they're really intense about your when you're driving here you can't go off even to let somebody buy you. Holy cow! Wow! Are you hearing this? Still got your pearls hanging by my bedside. Wow. I wish I brought my sketchbook. Lid. Still got your lips and paper in the trash now. Open the spaceship. Da -da -da -da. We just realized that we kind of forgot to eat today. We had apples and the tea, and now we're very hungry. What did you think of the crater, Dana? It was very beautiful. But mainly I'm just happy we had lunch. <laughs> that hit the spot. Uh, now what's our plan? I don't know. Drive through a couple rivers. Yeah? I just wanted to take this moment to thank all of the wonderful people who joined the patron community we recently launched. And a special thank you to our Patreons, Denise, Pat, Nancy, and Julie, for their generous support. We're so excited to build a community together with extra podcasts, Google Hangouts, a weekly newsletter, and a bunch of other rewards. So thank you to all our Patreons for making these adventures possible. Big day of off-roading, Dana. I love it. Do you? I want one. You want one of these cars? Yeah. If we get another van one day, can we get an off-road one? Yeah. Really? Yeah. It's so cool to just be able to drive wherever you want. Thank you so much for letting me drive. It's so fun. And then you get to film it all. It's a very good deal. The river crossings like get my heart going so much.
Good job, Dana. Thanks. That one was just a puddle. <laughs> but these are really fun. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. It's cool to have a, like a car that's so capable in comparison to Odie. Like I love Odie, don't get me wrong, but it's really fun to have a car that can like, you don't have to worry about it. So now we have to change the tire pressure because we're going from an off-road situation where we had lower pressure tires to a highway-ish situation where we're gonna have higher pressure tires. So we just have to get our air compressor out, which I think is right here, right? This? What about this? That's just to lower the pressure, to put the pressure in as a whole separate thing. Oh. Yeah. Can you show me how? Yeah. Cool. Let's do it. Dare you dig a little deeper It makes you feel a little stronger Who knows what you may find You'll see in your own time It might just take a little longer It all goes by so slowly You know, you're prepared for anything. I think that's so cool. Even as we pull out all his drawers, I'm like, you, this kind of vehicle, you can just make prepared for any situation, which is amazing. But mainly, I'm all exhausted. That was yeah. a really big day. Uh, I'm proud of myself. It was a big day. We went through rivers, up mountains, in craters. Iceland really has it all. Now we go to a campsite. Mm -hmm and make some dinner. Right? Mm -hmm. Good night. We will see you next week. This was a really fun adventure. Thanks for hanging with us. And more Iceland videos to come. Bum, bum, bum. All right, Lou, here we go. <laughs> a big thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this van life adventure through Iceland. We're still getting the hang of this awesome off-road camper. But thanks to our beautiful website, we can upload a bunch of photos from Iceland and look like real professionals in a matter of minutes, thanks to gorgeous portfolio designs and customizable layouts. So if you'd like a beautiful website to display your photography, head to squarespace.com slash wildlyroam for a free trial, and you'll save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain.